Today we're talking about why people are haters. Send me back with another video. <clears throat> Some was, I don't know what that was. But anyways, y'all, you feel me? I'm back with another video, as y'all can see. You know what I'm saying? Because you see me in the flesh. <laughs> okay. With a purple beanie on? Yeah. Yeah, I know everybody. Everybody's conceited too, so I don't, I don't, I don't want to hear none of that. You know what I'm saying? Besides that, you know what I'm saying. Today we're talking about why people are haters. You know, my five reasons why I believe anybody and everybody can be a hater. You know what I'm saying? And a hater don't always gotta be a negative thing. Sometimes a hater could be somebody that's like telling you something that you maybe knew. That was negative, but you needed to hear just so it can confirm that's negative and something you need to improve type thing. So, I don't know. I see it as being a hater, being a good thing and a bad thing at times. You know what I'm saying? But before we get into the video, you know what I'm saying? Talk about my five reasons. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for more of my videos. Also, let me know what, what other videos you guys want to see in the comments down below. You know what I'm saying? I just got some type right there. I don't know what it is today or right now yeah let's get into it so y'all this is what i had did okay now i have a bad habit of talking about something and by the end of the conversation i'm talking about something totally different so i had to write notes for me to remember what it is i'm gonna talk about so who a lot cares. of people Oh, oh. I won't go be all over the place or whatever. But, you know what I'm saying? My first one, y'all, I'm going to say is, you don't notice that they just don't support you. You know what I'm saying? And when I say they don't support, I don't mean they don't encourage you. They don't tell you you can do it. When I say don't support, I mean they literally don't support your work. They don't, you know what I'm saying? You have a business. You know, you got stuff in there that's probably for a dollar that they could buy that just support the show that you know what i'm saying they admire it they using that jump on you you know what i'm saying they got an instagram page you're trying to blow up on model they don't repost it because you know they just don't see it or you know you have a hair company they could buy hair from you for this one time <laughs> <laughs> they're not going to and it's not because of them not believing in you it's just that they don't support what you do yet you know what i'm saying they don't see how it could how it can benefit them you know they don't feel like it's worth whatever it is that you want from them so strictly i feel like that's why they just don't support you in a sense or they don't uh show that they care about your work put effort or any type of contribution towards what it is you want to do but yeah that's why i feel like that is for number one. Number two is I feel like it's their view of you. I feel like really how people view you it depends on if they're gonna support whatever it is you're doing. So like for instance, say Young and May, right? Everybody sees her as this rapper, this stud rapper, you know what I'm saying? From Chicago, she raps, she's cool. You know, you might see her as more if you know more of her, but I'm talking about for somebody that don't really know her, you know what I'm saying? You see her as this rapper she's dope da, 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 da. say she started a hair business what? now a lot of people that don't know too much only know base level stuff about her you gonna look at it like she don't know nothing about no hair oh. you know what i'm saying not to hate on her you know what i'm saying it's just like my view of you is that you don't really know much about that and until i can see that you know much about that i'm good like i'm, I'm good so it, it's like that too with certain things, I believe, that make people haters, you know what I'm saying? Because nobody don't like nobody 
that don't like, I mean, don't support what it is they like. Even if it's something they don't see you doing. You know what I'm saying? Even Arrogant Tay, for example, that man's doing hair. You know what I'm saying? He doing hair. I'm pretty sure he had his doubts when he was coming up with people being like, Oh, hell no. You're a guy. How do you know about hair? Because that's really a thing in society. Back then, people would be like, guys don't know how to do no hair. They don't know what they're doing. You know what I'm saying? He shut them down. But based off their view of him, they just <laughs> didn't see it. Number three. Number three. The third reason why I think somebody is a hater of yours is simply because their opinion on the subject. Their opinion on based off what they know about what you're doing. Now, y'all probably like, bro, what... What does that even mean? Like, what is she talking? What? Like, she don't know what she's talking about. No, y'all. What I'm trying to say is, basically, singing, for instance. Now, I can look at singing as, like, them, they just go on stage, grab a mic, and sing. Just like I do at home. Just like that, da, 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 So, what's so special about that? That's my opinion on singing. Now, that means that anybody else after that, or certain people based on how I view them and the subject, I'm gonna look at them like, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I already don't really mess with singing, and then you trying to do it? I just, I don't know, bro. I don't, I don't, I don't know if I'm gonna go through that type thing. But, really, it's one of your, it's one of your big things, you know what I'm saying? You just gotta prove them. You, like, again, you gotta prove to them that it's not that bad. Cause when somebody got an opinion on something that's negative, their bad opinion really overweighs any good thing that you tell them. So you really do gotta show them that it's not that bad. Like, you just gotta show them that it's not that bad. Whatever. Number four, I think, is a reason that people are haters. Number four really should have been number five now that I'm thinking about it. Yeah. But I'm going to say it anyway. I feel like people be hating, you know what I'm saying, whether it's good or bad, because of the fact that they want to do it too. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Y'all, listen, if you business savvy, if you, you got something that you know people around you want to do, yeah, they're going to knock you. For sure, not because of you maybe, not because they don't think you can do it, but because they don't see you doing what they couldn't do. You know what I'm saying? Like football, you got like 20 football players on one team. Damn! One team, bro. You got 20 or is it 15? I don't know how many football players it is on one team in high school, right? But only a select few of them go to college, play in the NFL. You got some, they go, but they just, you know what I'm saying, they're not picked. So, it is what it is. And people that ain't picked or people that don't drive themselves, they're going to not see you doing it because it was unbelievable because they couldn't do it. You know, like even a business. Somebody cannot see you running a business that you want to start because they don't take the time to do what they have to do on their own. So, I really think... With this one, I think it's more so inner with them and less about you again. It's more so with them and how they see it. Like, well, I've always wanted to do that. But if I couldn't do it, how could she do it type thing? You know what I'm saying? People are normally, I think it's just like a habit of them to be like that. I don't think it's something uh, mean, something like intentional to really like hurt your feelings or hurt anybody's feelings. I think that's just like a human being trait to have where... You look at it like, how you going to, yeah, all right, we going to see, yeah, all right, we going to see type thing, but it's what it is. And last but not least, y'all, we have number five. And this is like, I think this is just as big as number four. It's just as big because people don't understand this one. Number five simply is they don't like your work. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't like it. Anything that you're putting out is not for them. Like, it's maybe for somebody else. It ain't for them. So they're just not going to support it. They're just going to be seen as a hater to you, you know? And another example of what I mean by that is you, uh, 
let's see, maybe you started a clothing line, I guess, and your material is very different, something new, you know what I'm saying? No matter how booming it gets, you got these people that you want to check it out too. Five of them go check it out, right? Let's say five people go check it out. Check out your business that you know. And maybe three of them buy something. Two, you know, they be like, you know, I'm going to come back. One is like, uh-uh. <laughs> oh, hell no. Nah. <laughs> I'm good. I don't want to spend my I'm, I'm good, bro. I'm, I'm good. You probably like, bro, damn. But I saw you in that Gucci though, but you tell me you can't come in here and buy something for me? Supporting me? And they just tell you, just like this, listen, it ain't you. It's not you. It's just like, this material is not what I wear. It's not me. So I'm not finna just go for it because you're doing it. And now that I'm saying that out loud, it still sounds very hater-like and unsupportive, but it is a human being thing sometimes and i don't think again that it's like to offend you or to hurt your feelings or to make you feel like you know what i'm saying your work isn't good it's which as it isn't for that type of person and maybe like they try to tell you it's for other people and you know what i'm saying you gotta get over there like that so it is what it is but it is what it is but yeah y'all let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions Drop down below any other things you guys feel like make somebody a hater right off the bat. You know what I'm saying? Because you got to appreciate your haters. Those are the people that you got to, you know what I'm saying, work for. Not just them, but you know what I'm saying? You got to work for them too, though. They got to be in your sight. That's all I'm saying. But yeah, y'all let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions. If I should do more videos like this. And I'm going to see y'all for the next one.